can't talk today. Hey everyone, Yvette here with my winter fashion haul. Super excited to film a haul for you guys. It's definitely been a minute when it comes to the clothing hauls. I had, I think the last one was my summer fashion haul. If you are subscribed to us on our vlog channel, Those Formidable Girls, you know that Ruby and I have been doing Vlogmas. So you saw a little bit of my shopping adventures on there. But yeah, so I have a nice huge haul for you guys. So yeah, let's get into it. Ooh. So the first place I went to is Ross. And I don't know, I want to film a lookbook for you guys or a fashion video or something. So leave me a comment down below and let me know what fashion video you want to see next. I kind of want to do one on how I wear plaid. Are you guys interested in that? Do you want to see that? Let me know and I will do that for you. But this first thing that I got is like this poncho wraparound guy and it's all plaid and it was $22.99. Mira. So you put it on like this, like a cobija, and then, ah, and then you just like wrap it. Ooh, fancy, I know. So yeah, it just comes down like to my belly button so I could wear it así. Let me see if you can see that. So I could wear it like this, and then you could see like my arms still, or I could be super fancy and wrap it like that. But yeah, this was super cool find. It looks really expensive, but it's not. So, you know, I love that. Are you ready? I don't need shoes, you guys. Like, I don't, but I am the buying shoes. I couldn't resist. Aren't they so cute? They are from Steve Madden, also $22.99. I am a size 9, so yeah, I got some big old patonas on me. But aren't these adorable? They're like super glittery. I'm just in love. But oh, so cute. I love them. I saw them. I was like, you are mine. You're coming home with me. Let's check out. I also got this sweater and what's, how much is this this one was $14.99 and this is just like a cute Christmas sweater it has kind of like these poinsettias on it right here and then some reindeer and it's just super duper cute I wanted it in extra large so it can fit me a little bit baggy but they didn't have it so I was like oh do I get it do I not get it I just ended up getting it because I was like okay I'll just wear you fitted that is the look I'm going for. Should I show you my bras? No. What is that? That's not mine either. Okay. And then I also got this pencil skirt. I believe it was $8.99. I already wore it um, to an ugly Christmas sweater party that I had with my Focorico group. But it's just like a stretchy pencil skirt. Um, if you follow us on Instagram, you saw that I already posted this with the super obnoxious Christmas sweater. I put bells on it and like the whole time I was just dancing and I put like two of the bells like right here like you know like right here so I just like kept like shaking them around and everyone's laughing at me so much. It was just so much fun. Yeah so that we didn't have any alcohol or anything. I was just being silly all on my own so yeah what was I saying? Next I went to Charlotte Ruse and I think I only got two things. No I lied. Four things. Noise. Airplane? Oh, airplane. <laughs> I got these beanies and these were $10. And I couldn't decide between the mauve and the teal. So you know me, I had to get both. And they have these little pearls on them. And I can wear them like this or I can roll them up to me, really. But I thought these were so cute. I'll probably roll it. How cute. And then the teal one just looks so pretty with my hair. Look at that. Ida. So cute. Okay, I don't know how to put on beanies apparently. But. Huh. Yeah. And then I also got this dress from Charlotte Ruse. And all their dresses were $18 the day I went. This one was originally $30. But it cinches at the waist and then it has all these pleats. And it flares out a little bit. So it's very figure flattering and red. I loved it in red. I had it in black and I was like tempted to get it in black. But I was like, no, you have a lot of black dresses. Like if you're going to get a new dress, get something different. 
And then I also got this dress that I'm planning to wear for New Year's. And this one was also $18, originally $40. And I just like the scalloped um, sleeves on it. And I like the scoop neck. And I love all the shimmer shimmer look. Ooh, so cute. And then the bottom is um, scalloped too and it has a lining. But... <sighs> I know you're going to think I'm crazy because I told the sales associate that was there that I was going to cut it into a shirt because when I tried it on, I just loved everything about it, but it just wasn't figure flattering because it's a shift dress. And I don't know about you girls that are a little bit, you know, bootylicious and curvier. Us curvy girls can't wear shift dresses. It does nothing for our bodies. I think if you know how to rock a shift dress, like go for it, good for you. I can't rock a shift dress. It's for someone who's really petite. So I'm gonna cut it and wear it with a white skirt. I know, craziness, but I do alter my clothes all the time. So it's no big thing for me. And it has a little bit of a scoop back. So I have a more wide set back, so I definitely don't like anything that's too scoop, but this one's just like a little bit of a scoop. But yeah, this one's from Charlotte Ruse. So cute. And then maybe I'll make the bottom half a skirt or something. I don't know. So then from Nordstrom Rack, I only got two things. I went in to find my friend Gabby some boots because, okay, we went to Nordstrom Rack and she wanted these boots. They were super cute, but they only had two lefts. So... We were like, what? Like, where is the other two rights? But they only had two lefts. We're like, whatever. They don't have them. Like, let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Oh, my God. Are you guys obsessed with Frozen? I need to stop drinking coffee, you guys. I, I feel like I'm all over the place. Where was I? Okay, so we went to Nurse Rack. She didn't find the boots. Whatever. When she went back home on her way from Santa Barbara to the Bay, she found them. So, woohoo! Victory! Um, but, yeah, I got... This cute sweater guy. This was $19.97 and it was $40. So that's a pretty good deal, I think. I love all the little jewel guys that's right here. Super cute. And it has lace right here. So cute. And then it's like this oatmeal color, which I love. And I got it in extra large so it can be a little bit baggy. But yeah, it also has lace in the back. And this one was from Nordstrom Rack. Super super cute and then I also got dry shampoo this was $2.97 from Nordstrom Rack it was in ugh, that's why I don't like to wait in line really long times because that's where they have all the impulse buys things like this I did need dry shampoo I'm using the one from trust me right now I liked it when I had brown hair and highlights, but now with red hair, it leaves a white cast. So hopefully this doesn't do that. <sighs> Ready? I don't know if you guys care about pantuflas, but I do. How cute are these? Oh my god. These are so cute. They were $25, and I got them for $18. And they're super glittery and cute. I'm obsessed with glitter so super soft and comfortable and faux fur lining so yay for pantuflas so cute Ooh, fire spot that is it's so ratchet it doesn't even have a label on its bag okay whatever these bottoms you guys were only $3.99 how cute are these look they have a pink string and they're like a minty green and they're polka dot and they're just super comfortable cotton fabric. $3.99 at Fias Paderes. Super duper cool because I saw these even at Ross for like $12.99. So $3.99? Fuck yeah. So I couldn't just get one. So I had to get these. Also $3.99. You guys, how cute are these donut jammies? So these are a warmer fabric. And I feel silly saying like winter fashion haul because we don't get winter in California, but it gets a little chilly. So sometimes I like to bust out with these thicker um, pajamas and these have donuts on them. Reminds me of Homer Simpson. So cute. And then I also got these pajama bottoms, $3.99. 
super cute. I love the pink and the flannel. Hmm. I'm trying to be really good and say the price and where everything is from because I know like sometimes you're like, oh my god, I want it, but how much is it? That and I'm like, sorry, I don't know. I don't remember. And then I also got this sweater dress for $5.99. And it's like a charcoal color and it's like marbled and they didn't have large so I had to get the medium but it's okay it's a stretch so I'm gonna stretch this bad boy out um, it has like this oversized color um, but this one's cool it's marbled and it's like a charcoal color and it has like this like doodad knitted thing in the center hopefully you can see that and it has a little bit of rouging on the side. I don't know if you can see that. But hopefully you can see that. But yeah, that was only $5.99. Super cheap. by now. I know I've seen these at Forever for like $20. Bucks. Next I went to Hot Topic. And... Ooh, so if you follow us on Instagram, you know I'm obsessed obsessed with Disneyland and the Little Mermaid and Ursula and just Disney in general well actually if you're subscribed to our channel you know that too because we're always doing Disney makeups or once upon a time makeups or something like that but look you guys this was $8.50 but I got it on sale for $4 how cute is this little mermaid hair bow Oh, and it has a dingle hopper, super cute, and has scales on the teal bow, and then this purple one, like her bra, super cute. I love it, love it, love it, love it. Wear it when I go to Disneyland, but <laughs> I'm so sad because the last day for annual pass holders to go was like on the 18th or something, so I can't go again until like I think mid January. So, Ooh, sad day, whatever. Which I thought was so cute. How much was this guy? Oh, it says $40.50. I know I didn't pay $40 for this. Let my receipt. Boo! <laughs> this was $18. Yeah, I know I didn't pay $40 for it. But um, I forgot. I'm sorry. I forgot who asked me. But somebody on here asked me if I could do a Sally uh, tutorial from Nightmare Before Christmas. So that's why I bought the dress. And also, I'm going to wear it too, not just for the tutorial. Um... Probably wear it to Disneyland and stuff. But yeah, somebody asked me if I could do a Sally from Nightmare Before Christmas makeup tutorial. And I was like, okay, well, I have to buy the dress because I already have the red hair. So usually when we do Halloween tutorials or more theatrical tutorials like that, we like to, you know, like add a little extra pizzazz and put on pizzazz. Pizzazz? Yeah, pizzazz. Uh, and put on wigs and then costumes and things like that just to, you know, like complete the look. But yeah, this one... Is from Hot Topic and then also from Hot Topic I got this shirt and it's a Hunger Games shirt and it was only ten dollars so I got this guy it's just a plain black t-shirt usually that's what I wear when I'm running errands and stuff like if I'm just gonna go like what am I saying what am I explain to you when I wear t-shirts silly and then the last thing from Hot Topic is this super cute oh my god so cute this uh little mermaid aerial beanie and it's like this nice ombre teal into white and this was only 650 and it was 20 bucks so that's awesome love this so cute where to Disneyland I should have called this a Disneyland haul but I feel like that's the only place where I can get away with wearing stuff like this because girl you need to know how to put on a beanie look at you yay <laughs> love this this isn't winter at all it's a freaking muscle tee or whatever but it's so cute I just bought it before Sandbar closed um, it's a restaurant in um, Santa Barbara and it says save water drink tequila and it has this sugar skull on it so cute and I think it was like 20 bucks or something but this is a large, okay? Like, I'm really going to have to stretch this guy out. <laughs> Next, I went to Target. This is not the Target bag. This is Ulta. Where's my Target stuff? So I only got a couple things at Target. I mainly got Christmas gifts for my mom and for Jose. And I think that's it. But 
I got, well, my friend I met, she got this skirt. And it was $7. And when I saw her with it, I was like, I want it too. It's so cute. It's this red and charcoal marble sweater material. And it has a stretchy uh, waist. And it's knitted. And it's just super cute. And it was only 7 bucks. So I was like, yeah, coming home with me. Got this kind of croppish. It's not really cropped. This shirt, it was $22.99 and I got on sale for $6.88. And it's just so cute. It has a little bit of a turtleneck on it and it has it's sleeveless and has this cute print purple and like blue and black and white on it. And it's just like a cute little crop top. And then the back is really nice because it has this cutout in it and then these little Julie guys to clip on in the back and I'm like I never I'm I'm like a large you know extra large uh, what am I in jeans it varies in jeans between like 13 to like 15 and randomly I'm like a 16 and super randomly I'm like a 12 so I don't know what I am but I just have to try it on but for shirts I feel like I could wear something why did I say that? And then I also got this Nirvana um, Heather Gray, Charcoal Gray tee. I love Nirvana. I was definitely a grunge girl in the 90s listening to Nirvana and stuff. And i just been looking for a nice Nirvana tee. And this baseball one is just super adorable. I should have included this in my beauty haul, but I filmed that before I went to Ulta, but oh, so cute. I got this Hot Tools for 30 bucks, you guys. It was like $30 with tax and everything at um at Ulta, and I got the one-inch barrel. Yeah, and then they had this pretty color. This one's a teal, and they had purple and blue and like a turquoise and a pink. I didn't see any more pink, but I saw the picture, but yeah, it was like so cute has like this gold hardware on it. I always use the one that Ruby has. Um, Ruby's had hers forever and I've used it in a couple hair tutorials. Um, I'll probably link one down below if you want to check it out but I had to get my own and I needed like a one inch one so I was like yeah. I love that this one has temperature settings because I don't know if you guys knew this or not but you're not. Don't you should <laughs> But you should always buy your hair tools with temperature settings if it's supposed to have heat in it because everybody's hair is different. Like if you have very coarse hair, you have like very thin hair, dyed hair and curly hair and straight hair, like everybody's supposed to be at a different temperature setting. Um, if you guys want me to make a video about it, I can. Um, just let me know in the comments below. But yeah, this one's so pretty. It's a tempting teal. Stylist preferred. Well, I'm not a stylist, but I prefer this. So Yes, that's everything. Whew, what a haul. That was a lot of crap. But yeah, that was everything. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you stayed till the end, God bless you. Um, but yeah, I just have so much fun shopping like... When I was Christmas shopping for people, I just couldn't help myself and I had to get stuff for myself. But hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Um, thumbs up if you want to see more hauls. Let me know. Let me know if you want to see a lookbook or anything like that. Or just any tutorials that you want to see. And Ruby and I will do that for you. Um, definitely go check us out on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter. Formidable Artistry just had spelled here. And I'll see you next time. Bye!